guys welcome back to the channel in this video i will cover the hbar hedera price action the imminent short-term price action and of course my longer term outlook can we expect a breakout today out of this symmetrical triangle that is what i'm going to discuss in this important video before we start like this video and if you want to take your trading towards the next level then check out my trade signal group first link in the description or just scan the code on the right side of your screen i'm trading on bitget and bitget is a non-kyc exchange it has zero trading fees and if you sign up through my link in the description you can claim big rewards and discounts and you support the channel as well so definitely go check that out and let's now dive straight into the technicals here so this is the daily time frame for hbar hedera my view still remains the same i think the bear market low for hbar was in at the 1st of january 2023 at 3.5 cents since then we moved up impulsively in a wave one to the upside came down in a wave two moved up in an explosive wave three and it looks like right now we are trading within this wave four correction and afterwards there will be a fifth wave to the upside another possibility is that this wave three was actually never in and the wave four and five is also still yet to come but uh, i'm personally uh, right now looking at this scenario that we are in this wave four the price action is forming some kind of a symmetrical triangle which is normally a continuation pattern towards the upside um yeah on the way up we got a lot of increasing volume here on the daily time frame as you can see below and in this correction we actually got decreasing volume this is telling you that the trend is up and we can still expect higher prices very soon for hbar if we take a look at the daily bollinger bands we can clearly see that we got support here from the mid level of this bollinger band and we are still trading within the upper region of the daily sorry guys of the daily bollinger bands so according to this we are still bullish and we should still be prepared for higher prices uh, however a wave four can be sideways and pretty boring so it is it wouldn't surprise me if we would trade sideways for a few more days maybe even a week or two that is all possible but from any moment in time we sh we could uh, expect a breakout to the upside because hbar already uh, went deeply in my green support box which is the perfect retracement here for this possible wave four because if i grab the uh, fibonacci retracement tool and from off this swing low towards the swing higher we can actually see that the 0.236 in white and also the 0.382 is perfectly aligning with this green box so the lowest i see h bar going in the imminent short term is possibly around six cents and the higher and the support started already at 6.7 cents so what if we break down what if we lose this green box then i do expect h bar to find support around 5.5 cents all the way down possibly towards five cents so that would be the next support area but first of all we are trading within this zones here so we should be prepared for a breakout from any moment in time and what if we go higher from off this point what is the first resistance that we need to break through obviously first of all we need to break that 7.2 cent region that's the 0.5 fibonacci retracement level if we break that level then i do expect further continuation towards 10 cents for h bar if we zoom out here we can actually see that more clearly this downward sloping um, resistance line is basically in play from off the start of the bear market back in 2021 several touch points and this line is perfectly coming into play at 7.2 cents so this is a critical area that we need to break through and and uh, if we do so, then I do expect further continuation towards 10 cents because measured from off the Altamai towards the swing low here, that is the 0.382 Fibonacci retracement level. So yeah, that is what I expect for H bar. Uh, you know the support levels, you know the resistance levels. Let's check out the indicators here on the daily time frame. So the momentum is still pushing down. I see this on a lot of other cryptos as well. We were under a sell signal basically from off the 22nd of January and the momentum is still pushing to the downside stochastic rsi already oversold here a limited potential to go lower and very soon i do expect this to um, yeah continue further to the upside again and the macd indicator on the uh, daily time frame however is seeing saw a bearish crossover just a few days ago and we are still trending down on this indicator um, the rsi on the daily time frame currently sitting at 56 
so yeah let's see today uh, is go it's going to be an important day we're going to get the federal reserve rate hikes for february and that is going to have a tremendous effect on the market so this could potentially uh yeah push h bar to the upside or to the downside so let's see later today how that will play out uh if i see major volatility i'll be back with another update later today and otherwise i'll be back tomorrow with another h bar video please like this video and subscribe to my channel i want to thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye bye